Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Creating Process. Today we'll give comic book effect to an image using Photoshop. First, we'll create half tone of the image, then we'll add effect of brush strokes to make it feel like painting. We'll also add frame border using stroke option and adjust the RGB values using curve adjustment layer. So let's begin the tutorial. Open the folder containing the images. Choose the image where you want to give this effect. Drag and drop it to Photoshop document. Now under layer panel, double click on the image to unlock the layer. Next, create a duplicate of this image and go to filter, pixelate, color half tone. Under this panel, give the radius value to around 8 pixel. You must try out different values for your image as the image size may vary. Next, set the layer opacity to around 51% and change the layer mode to overlay. This will give a nice half tone pixel effect. Now the image is looking like a poster. Next, we'll give frame border to the image. So select the main image and go to Effects Stroke. This will open the layer style panel. Here change the color to white, set the position to inside, increase the size to 8 pixel and click OK. Now create a duplicate of the layer. Select the middle layer and reduce the fill to 0%. Next open the stroke option for the last layer. This time change the color to black and increase the size to 18 pixel. This will add a perfect border to the frame. Next, duplicate the layer one more time. We'll use this new layer to add a brush strokes to the image. To do that, select the layer and go to Filter, Sharpen, Smart Sharpen. Under Smart Sharpen panel, adjust the amount and radius value to add fine stroke details to the image. Set the amount value to 371% and the radius value to 6.2%. Now you can see the outline in hands, nose, hair and if you look at the fur, you can see the strokes. Now create a dialog box using the rectangle tool, change the fill color to white, add a stroke from the effects, change the stroke color to dark red and the size to 6 pixel. Next type out the dialog text. Change the font to adventure regular. Next select the ellipse tool, add two white circles. Apply the same stroke effect as the rectangle. With the R press, just click and drag to apply the same effect. Next, type out the title. Change the font color to white and apply this font. Now, add stroke on the layer style panel. Choose the position to outside. Keep the stroke color to red and click OK. Finally, to increase the contrast of the image, add curve adjustment layer just above our main image. Adjust the curve and form a S shape. This way, we have applied this effect to another image. We have used Smart Sharpen option to add brush stroke lines to the image. Finally, we have finished creating comic book effect. I hope you enjoyed the tutorial. Don't forget to check out the next tutorial coming up. And if you are more interested in designing, please like, share, and subscribe to this channel. Thank you.